going on, everybody? Welcome back to Tune Talk, episode 20. We got Tim, we got Garrett, and a special guest, everyone's favorite guest, Eric. Eric, before we start, new intro. Everyone what an intro. To it. It rips. Insane. I figured, you know, 20th episode, I spice it up a little bit, get a little bit more, you know, guitar in there, make it more full. I mean, it's getting, this is getting real. You know, this podcast is becoming a legit thing. So we got to make it sound and look legit. I agree. I told you before, we're reaching tens of people. Dozens. Dozens and dozens. dozens. <laughs> Where are we at right now, subscribers? When's the last time we had a full phone? Uh, 62, last time I checked. Tim just knows all the time, which was like an hour ago. Tim checks Tim checks every hour to see where we're at. See, I've got it pulled up right now. <laughs> every 30 minutes, get it right. Dude, oh. we have 71 videos total. Well, yeah, we post like two a week. Plus, I uploaded like yeah, all the old ones, all the old ones that are yeah. like you know twelve seconds long or whatever. Yeah, but I mean, yes, yeah, so that's, that's a lot of videos. Yeah, yeah. a lot of videos, content. a lot of subscribers. Oh, yeah, that's right. We're in the content. We're in the content game. <laughs> um, all put right. that on my resume, content creator. Don't put that on your resume. <laughs> hey, hey, you know what it's all about? You got to you got to put pod. You can put podcaster. You're not a content creator. <laughs> This is content. What are you it's talking a, about? Well, you're, yeah, but it's a podcast. Yeah, Tim's more special effects creator. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Have you seen the red light and the costumes? Yeah, I'll tell you what, you, but you won't, you won't be seeing the red light this week. That's for sure. Ooh. <laughs> and that right, Tim. You know, sometimes it happens. I didn't have Dan there. <sighs> really? Dan? <laughs> Where is, there it is. Uh, all right. Are we just gonna jump into it? Yeah. Well, I, yeah. I, listen, we there is a there is a there was some contention before we even started before we even started recording, and I think it's gonna boil over. Um, it's a little excited. To listen, talk listen, <laughs> listen. It took a lot longer than I expected, but 19 days into 2022, and I've already broken my New Year's resolution. So <laughs> that was that was fun while it lasted. I guess. <laughs> Nice beer, Eric. Yeah, uh, you too, huh? Yeah, I have a story behind that one, but okay. Uh oh. Uh oh. Eric Wait, a story, a story behind. A story behind what? Me starting the drink again. Uh oh. Uh oh. Should we? I pause the show. Wait, no, I didn't mean my drinking resolution. I meant my oh. yelling at guys oh, on no, the bench no, I, resolution. I know Eric just held up a beer because I know he said he was going to cut back a little bit. Oh. Well, <laughs> little no, did Eric know this is uh. You know, an AA meeting for him. Yeah, this is a safe space. This is a safe space. Nope. No, it's all right. So, so what happened? Uh, so Midland League, uh, Monday night had a game. We won in a shootout. Uh, I think it was six to five. Uh, unfortunately for myself, mm -hmm. I was voted by the team as the worst and or most embarrassing player of the week. Um, <laughs> I oh, had. Wow, wow. About seven opportunities to score and did not put one in the net. Yeah, in Goonie Tunes fashion, that checks so, out. Yeah, yeah. Some it's been a been, been a rough year for me. We haven't had a Midland minute in a while. Yeah, it's. Uh... Oh, don't worry, we'll get there. Oh, okay. Hey, it won't. You won't need a minute. <laughs> <laughs> uh oh boy, it was a rough one <laughs> Sunday, late night, late game. Made some moves. A couple guys. Yeah. yeah. Some of them worked. Some of them didn't. Uh, uh, I would say none of them worked. We got one goal. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Fair, <laughs> fair <laughs> enough. <laughs> fair enough. Like, I'll tell you, we didn't really have many shots either. I we may have had 10 shots on net. We had at least three or four scrambles in front of the net where, you know, like Bice, well, Bice's wasn't really a scramble. Bice had his, his signature clapper from like just yeah. outside the dot. <laughs> Starts like to half, pass the it's goal. Like half it's, like, it's like it's that. Bring up that clip of the goalie looking at the puck. On the, <laughs> oh uh, yeah, the, the, the <laughs> little kid where it's just, where it's just it's spinning on the spinning. goal line. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah Bice with his half clap. Yeah. Now, but we really just couldn't get. I mean, they were good. They're, they're a good team. We knew that yeah. they have some yeah. good players, but yeah. a team like that, you just got to have one of your more solid games, and that definitely wasn't a solid game from us. I mean, where we were missing our two best defensemen. Uh, yeah. Brown and Eric weren't there, so wow, it was a tough. No, not even Reader. Best oh shit! Defenseman. Yeah, I forgot about Reader. Yeah, he wasn't there. Oh, either. so so easily forgotten about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just trying to get him pissed off and motivated for this weekend. So hopefully he's listening. And it's like, what the fuck, Connor? Um, Still my joke. 
Tim, do we want to just do you want to get it out of the way now or do you want to wait and just have us keep beating around the bush? <laughs> oh, we lost Tim. So I guess I guess we can just talk about it while he's not here. Uh, raw meat. Raw meat play of the week goes to Tim. Somebody's been feeding Johnny raw meat. Look at him go. <laughs> yeah. Not quite, Tim. Tim's equipment. Oh, Tim's Lord equipment almighty. got the raw meat play of the week. Uh, so we talked about this last week. Uh, Tim wears his elbow pads backwards. Uh, I don't know if you can see it. They're on the right elbow. They're just backwards and upside down. Uh, so I don't know how that works. I feel bad for his elbow pads. And then his stick, uh, when he beefed it into the boards, his, I've never seen someone's stick go that far off of just falling into the boards before. And in a perfect spot to block a shot. Yeah, yeah, Tim's I mean, like, you couldn't have done that better, like with your body. Tim Damn. stick, Tim stick has more shot blocks than he does this year. Yeah. Oh no. Oh God. He was on his cell phone. Guys. He's on his cell phone. It's going to echo. <laughs> yeah. Did your, did your computer die? No, the uh, internet is being weird. Oh, uh, you know. you're on your phone. <laughs> hey, will you do me a favor? I'm going to tell you the same thing I tell that stupid ass Buckley. Will you turn your camera sideways so it takes? There you go. Thank you, man. That's kind of interesting how Tim and Buckley have the same issue. Yeah, the same problem with a phone. It's weird. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> this is so scuffed. Tim, welcome to the podcast. <laughs> episode one. Ep- episode episode twenty. twenty. Oh, shit out. <laughs> We got a sweet new intro and outro, but Tim had to pay for it. We had to sell Tim's computer. Tim couldn't, Tim, Tim couldn't afford his internet bill. He's getting it next to Magoo's outlet. Yeah. <laughs> Tim, we uh, we were just talking about how your you didn't win raw meat play of the week. Your uh, your equipment did. Your elbow pads and your stick. Do you uh, care to comment? Hey, you know. Um... I guess somebody had to win it. You know, they're out there making great plays. I think anytime I get on the ice and I'm and I don't fuck up, then that's a win. So I don't know. You didn't have much of that this week. No, it was a rough one for me, <laughs> but you know, what are you I tell you what, it got it got so bad and I was I, I was I could tell you were getting frustrated that at one point in the third period. I was streaking across the middle and you threw a pass that was like three feet behind me. Oh, it's I, awful. I, I didn't even say anything. I just looked at you on the bench and you're just like, I fucking know. Okay. I know. <laughs> <laughs> like, I didn't even say anything. Didn't want to yell. I'd already chirping you too. What's that? I said, we even had Behrman chirping you too. I, oh, okay. Lord. I just, can we just, you, you had a little bit of a relapse. And, I, and yeah, like I said, New Year's, we got it. New Year's resolution is already done and failed. Um, but I just, it's just like, so I, we had a little conversation in between, in between the second and the third period, because we were having a hard time generating offense, which is understandable yeah. considering we were a little bit short on defense, but our biggest problem was our defensemen were just throwing the puck up the boards. We weren't making passes. We weren't getting chances, which is like, that's fine. If you're not, if you don't have time and you're getting pressured, but we had a lot of time to make a play. So I said, defenseman, you have more time than you think. Take a second, make a pass. Second shift out there. Garrett has the puck in our zone, in the corner. Nobody on him. Take the puck behind the net. Stop. Go the opposite direction. Pass to Embry. Breaks out. Yep. And then it comes back. Then I get a little pressure on me. No, There Nobody was no happy. pressure. I was cutting through I the slot the video. I had in the open right behind me and instead <laughs> and of make and instead of making the easy the, the the pass you just flipped it up into the netting yeah it was it was came off the, the stick a little funny i'll give you that what but hey it? i got it out of the zone <laughs> face off came back in the zone but out of the zone so yeah, yeah I, got a, I got a little bit upset i got a little heated yeah i blame that the last game 100 percent on our d so I'm with you there, Connor. <laughs> Thank you, Tim. Uh, yeah, good, good call. Thank you, Tim. Call, Tim. Let's just okay. One second. Here. Let me let me edit the lines real quick for next week. <laughs> hey, make here. sure make sure you ask John first to make sure he's in. Who who's that? We'll get to John even, later. I don't even we'll know who that is. No. We can get to this right now. Uh, Garrett, I mean, I I think it's pretty safe to say the Garrett on defense experiment uh, was a complete and utter failure. 
I didn't. Best I didn't realize you couldn't skate backwards. That's I on me. Backwards. That's on me. Know, like I don't think it was just me, but that ice was pretty bad. I I fell plenty of times. You got to agree. You're blaming I it agree. on the ice. I can't yeah. wait to this weekend what you can Tim, blame it on. Did, oh, you, no, yeah. You and Tim were the only ones that were falling out there. No, Phil no, Brandon. no, no. Yeah. Phil you're, had you're, you're blaming people that fall re- regularly. The game before us, there were people falling all over the place. But it was it was not good ice. Now, mind you, it's a pretty shitty excuse. I'll acknowledge that. But I, I you, couldn't keep my I don't. I wasn't even worried about you falling. I'm just specifically talking about you just, like, not being able to skate backwards. Oh, I mean – I got burnt a couple of times. If I'm burnt, uh, game over, man. I mean, what? I can either, you know, hustle back. The and one, the, one in the, the one I put in the highlight video where Bray made the save and the guy literally just skated around you. And as he went around you, you just turned and kind of like shrugged your shoulders. Like, yeah, well, yeah, he's exactly. gone. <laughs> I mean, I'm guy, not catching guy, him. He burnt everybody at least three he times. Was, he was pretty, he was pretty quick. But just like you yeah. utter, you're just like complete, just like, Ah, it's over. He's by me. Exactly. I'm, I'm not pulling a groin for this. Yeah. <laughs> That's hey, exactly Garrett, what went through my head. <laughs> now Garrett knows how Poon Patty feels every Sunday. Oh, boy. Hey, I get it. I know the struggle. See, but here's the difference. And I got a little frustrated at Poon Patty, which probably wasn't all that fair because, you know, fair. The, the bar the bar is at different levels for different players. I just expect more out of you, Garrett. Uh-oh. You played hockey your whole life, so I have, okay. a certain, I have a certain expectation level for you, and when you just throw the puck into the net instead of hitting me wide, what me wide open me with a pass, I get a little. I would have had to go through two players. Look no, at the tape. I looked no. it because I knew you're going to bring it up. No, look at the tape. You can even pull it up. I, I hope you pull it up when we're talking about it. Okay. Well, I'll pull Garrett, it up. I will. I will say one thing you are good at. What's that? Serving your country. Thank we you for that. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Okay, Don King. <laughs> Oh shit. It was a rough one. I think I I was going back. I think this is the first time we've been two games below 500 all season. We've been bouncing yeah, 500 but one below just pretty much all yeah. season. Yeah, we've been like one, one game above below. or one game below pretty much yeah. the whole season. But yeah, this is the first time I think we've been. And I forget who we uh I was talking to, but we were talking about all the late it might have been Craig. All of our 10 o'clock games I think are against Stanley PT. They yes. are. So they typically have a decent showing of, and they're all good guys. And we tend to struggle to get some of our players at those late games. So, yeah, which is unfortunate because I know the owner of that team. And yeah, like Earl to- was, he's always looking for you. Yeah, right? Earl was asking, yeah, he goes, always, Where's like, Eric? I go, He's scared of you. He's scared of you, Earl. He knows you're out here. He, oh, he, he knows he I'll handle. throw my fat ass into his <laughs> hip. He'd go down he, like a sack tripped, of dirt. He tripped me like a son of a bitch. I was around him on a breakaway <laughs> and he tripped me. Didn't even, I, didn't even apologize. Maybe I might I have to do that on that, that play. <laughs> What's <laughs> that? The guy. So maybe that's what I should have done on that. Yeah, play you should have just tripped him. I knew Bray was going to make the save. I might have to oh, nut yeah. up that last game. One of the break we trust. Again? There you go. Uh, probably like a month or so. I might nut up and just yeah. do that last game. I think game. it's our last game of the regular season. I might basically. have to do that. Okay. Nut up or shut up. That's right. Uh, yeah, see if you can get like the last day off or Monday off. Nah, I ain't worried about it. I'll just suffer through my yeah. full holiday. Um, Family PT Sun is our last regular season game, 10 15, February 27th. All right. Nice. Well, Garrett. So obviously, like we said, I think moving you back to forward is going to be the. We'll see. You know, I, we'll see. I don't mind playing D again. Just kind of. Still no, I'm going to go lead. ahead and just just say I think we need to move you back to forward. <coughs> we'll we can we can out. we can try somebody else out back there, but I don't know. Maybe give Phil a shot. Who else do we got back? <laughs> give Phil a shot. Let's move. I don't know. That's I, it's not like he's putting up points anyway. That's true, Tim. That's true. But, but by hey. that logic, we should have left Craig back on D. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah. Fair. That's fair. Yeah. But Craig was sucking wind pretty hard halfway through the first period. Yeah, he well, was. He's playing wing. He should be. Well, he played all right. I, I've got no issues with the way yeah, he played. No, he, yeah, yeah, no, he, played, he, yeah, he, he played, played fine. All right. Yeah. We were it, just making – we were just missing some of our uh, more skilled experience. players. Experience. D. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Experience D is a good way to put it. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, Garrett. So gone goblet. I think you uh, had some words to say with, with Fuckley after the game, right? I just answered the questions that, you know, Fuckley asked and uh, yeah, I don't know. Do you want to send it to him? 
Yeah, we'll send it to to you and Fuckley. <laughs> Fuck, we back at it for the second week in a row. Uh, Goblet winner Garrett, uh, what do you think about her performance tonight? Well, you know, I, I played back in D, uh, definitely caught some edges. Got to work on skating backwards. Definitely there, not my forte. I noticed a little turmoil uh, towards the end of the game. Uh, we were down two goals, but we didn't pull the goalie. Yeah, you know, uh, I came up the ice after, after a hard shift, uh, one of my better ones, and I thought we had a chance to put two away. And uh, start yelling to Bray, and, and all of a sudden I hear the uh, the other Fred line on the bench. I won't name which one, so you know it could be anyone. I don't uh, think Eric was here this week, right? I don't know. We'll have to check the, uh, yeah, the tapes on right. that one. But uh, he said we're not pulling them, so I guess uh, winning spirit isn't with everybody on the team. Yeah. Uh, we might have to make some moves, and uh, we'll fix it next week. All right. One final question: uh, Who's your favorite Simpsons character? Mm, Got to be Duff Man. Man, it's all about the hip thrust. All right. All right. I, what are we? What are we doing, Garrett? Are we talking about the camera work? Or what are we talking I, about? No, the, I mean, the camera's better than it was last <laughs> week, but... Buckley's getting better. Yeah, that's... Yeah. A, okay, yeah. sure. Why am I getting blamed for not pulling the goalie? Because I can't... Okay, so I came off... Uh, that's, that I, should never be my decision. Because that was your I, team. No, 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 yes. And here's what happened. I came off the ice of my last shift. Why didn't we pull the goalie? I'm looking at Tavis. Tavis says... I asked Connor. Connor said we're not pulling the well, goalie. The, first of all, the puck was in our zone that entire shift. Nah, I'm pretty sure there was a point where it was in our – yeah. we should have pulled it. Eh. Now, if I was wrong, I was wrong. But I'm pretty sure – because I came off asking why we didn't pull the goalie already. Yeah. And that's why. It's because somebody yeah. said not to pull the goalie. I was going to listen. That didn't imply like, oh, it wasn't the right time, so Connor said not to. It was implied that somebody was a little salty at the end of the bench. I just said, I just said, who cares? Don't pull him. It was kind of yeah, like someone was... gave up on the game. Yeah, That's it was 11 o'clock. Like. There was a minute and a half to go. We had like six shots on net the whole game. Yeah, solid seven or eight. Yeah. Uh, I was ready. I was, the refs were ready to go hey, home. I was ready to go home. You know, you know who you reminded me of when I heard that? Your father. I was going to say my dad probably. Yeah, <laughs> yeah that checks out. I, I know, I know you meant. I know you meant that as an insult, but I'll take that. Uh, as I mean, a compliment. take it how you will. I don't mean as an insult. I just it's spitting the truth. Just fits. Your dad yeah. gets salty. You get salty. <laughs> we're we're just competitive, and when we're losing, we're sore losers. I so said you I was try to win. I was said I was gonna. <laughs> I I would love to try to win. I do everything I can to try to win. I try to give advice. I try to yeah. pump the guys up. And when, and and meanwhile, you got Harvey's kid. Eh. Eh, nah. I got burned. Nah. I'm, I, I got burned. I won't. Because I know how Harvey is. How's uh, that feel, Harvey? Uh, nah. I got uh, the puck out. I got the puck out hey, of the zone. I just great that I'm out there. Hey, yeah. Hey, hey, Connor, hand me that beer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Uncle Harvey. That's mine. Oh, oh, man. Yeah, you can't have it both ways. But have it both ways. You can't be <sighs> just like, ah, we're, we're just out here to have a good time. Who cares if we win or lose? And then what are you talking about? Who's, who's implying that? <laughs> that's your whole thing. We're just out there to have a good time and have a couple beers after well, the yeah, game. Yeah, yeah. We're out there to have a good time, but we're still out there to win if we can. All right. If, so what's more important, winning or having a good time? Having a good time. Okay. So then who gives a shit if we're down three to one? And when there's a minute and a half to go, why do we have care if we're winning? Hockey, Connor? No, I have. I think the okay. points. So I, what I think happens the point... when you're down in the last minute of a hockey game by like one or two goals typically? I didn't think pulling the goalie would be fun. I didn't turn the X. You turn the Xbox off. You turn the Xbox off before the game ends. That's right. Yeah, you <laughs> rage quit. I rage <laughs> quit. I rage quit and threw the controller at Ben. That's exactly what happened. Oh, I got no problem man. admitting that. I did that more than a couple times. <laughs> There's a few wall, wall holes in my wall at home. <laughs> yeah. I think Ben had a black eye at one point. Oh um, yeah. I mean, that's what little brothers are for. Oh yeah. Yeah. Um, bag. But you know what? Rough game overall. I got no qualms getting the goblet. Uh, probably because I had the roughest game of all. So, no, uh, I'll be back next week to fill your shoes. Don't worry. There you go. Yeah, we have two two goblet slash toilet winners on the show this week. Yeah, that's something wow. you don't see very also, often. Also, I would have said OJ Simpson or maybe Jessica Simpson. Besides, was it Mo? I said Duffman. No, he wrote Duffman. Duffman. Oh, favorite Duff, Simpsons Duff, character yeah. OJ. Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. I see. What you're ah, saying. Nice. Yeah. Uh, nice. Uh, well done. Well done. Yeah. Well done. <laughs> That's why we that's why we bring him on, folks. Yeah. That's why he's everyone's favorite guest. All right, host. Eric Fredlife, we'll see you yeah. next week. 
Oh boy. Well, yeah, here's, I mean, this would be six guys again. I feel like this, oh, this page yeah. is more crowded and crowded every week. It's crazy. Yeah. Brown, we're, we're going to talk about Brown. He's injured. He'll be yeah. back in a couple oh, weeks. Wait, Two weeks. Three weeks? Mid February. Yeah, yeah, February. Can't come soon enough. Eric, it's a late one. Hour uh, drive, it's a late one. I know. Family PT, I, I, I'm going to do it. I'm just going to suck it up. I might stay at home, go. bring the company down as donuts the next day. We'll see. There, All right. There yeah, you go. There you go. Yeah, sweeten the deal. Yeah, you got to play Earl at least once. I know. He wants it. I don't, I don't know if he does. Well, because we haven't beat him when you were there. Ooh, you never know. That's true. Little Eric's secret sauce. Sauce. Yeah. <laughs> I know. Yeah, I know. I'll bring know. My, my Frank's hot sauce for next, <laughs> next <laughs> <game. Sauce>. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, throw some sauce. I know it was past Tom's bedtime. Yeah. yeah. Way past Tom's Sweet bedtime. Beauty. Yeah. So that is what it is. Uh, Dan had a pretty legitimate reason. Yeah. Yeah. Brother, brother yeah brother had positive, covid so, so. He, uh, yeah stayed home i get it which stayed is home. the smart the smart thing to do safe thing to do yeah. no problem with that reader i think uh was up in gaylord ice fishing checking out the ice for Ooh, the okay. for the yeti cup this weekend Scouting. yep yeah nice. he was out on out on the lake doing some ice fishing checking checking the stuff out said it was very very cold hmm, so okay. we have that to look forward to lovely yep. And then, uh, yeah, that's it. That's everybody that we were missing. Yeah. Right. Who, who's that's. Yeah, that was five. Is that... Oh, oh, <laughs> well, uh, yeah, well, okay. I mean, Is that I one in the top right? I... Was that from like Getty images or something? That's a stock photo. I accidentally, I accidentally <laughs> left in there by mistake. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, at this point, it's like we, we've, we've kind of beating this horse to death uh so i saw him last night he is alive and well in case anyone was wondering um i said hey you know sunday we have an early game are you in um yeah yeah i think so oh, oh boy <laughs> i said john i'll drive oh okay there's no way he's coming to that game on sunday nope there's no way we'll see did garrett freeze no, my no. somebody called my phone. Oh, because you 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 were not moving and just no, staring I mean, at the I, screen. Yeah, I just that, like, everything went away except for like the number in the corner. I'm like, how the hell do I get rid of this? What a what a show! We got Garrett getting phone calls. Yeah, Tim's internet going out. Episode twenty, folks. This is this is <laughs> why you <laughs> this is why you tune into Tune Talk. <laughs> the internet. <laughs> oh man. There's no chance John's there on Sunday. We'll we'll see. Uh, no. If I can convince him, I mean, I'm going to be spending at least three hours in the car with him. What's an extra hour there and back? There you go. I'm driving. Like well, he, hasn't, he won't he won't have seen his though. he won't have seen his won't have seen his family until since like Friday oh, afternoon. Show up too, man. You know. Drive I don't the think they're making. I don't think they're making the drives. I mean, Garrett, you got noise on the corner. for their kids, right? Yeah, not quite. But what's that? You have noisemakers for their kids. Yeah, right? I got noisemakers. Oh no, I can't. <laughs> what, what, no, why are you you're, telling us to shut go let this, the dog out, right? This is oh, the no, part no, of the. I, I this is the. Here. This no, is the yeah, part uh, of the show. No, so this they is, came in today. Oh, God. They're loud as fuck. I mean, like ear. Oh, oh great! Oh great! Ow. Yeah, no, I'm sure the fans in the stands are gonna love it. Oh, I would say this great. is the part of the show where Garrett loses internet privileges for a week. Yeah. You woke up, Leo. Yeah, don't wake up, Leo. Oh yeah, I boy! Thought I had him over here, but I put him downstairs. Well, hopefully we have a better turnout this uh, this Sunday. It's an early game. Six, Family six, in six theory, 15. we should only be missing one guy. Who do we play? Yeah, looking at Dirty our bench app, it looks like Dirty we work. already are going Ooh. to have a better turnout. Turnout. Dirty worker on a little bit of a heater. Yes. Oh. Yeah. Yep. They spanked Mercino last week. Ooh, look at look Ooh. at the colors too. <laughs> yeah, you like that? Yeah. Yeah. Very upgrade, nice. Great upgrade for episode twenty. I added <laughs> colors. <laughs> We just need their logos in there next. We'll be solid. That's what I'm. I'm working on that. We're working. Progress. And we have updated week ten scores. And we have updated yeah. week ten scores. Uh, I made it. I made a note. I made a note in the rundown to make sure I didn't forget. Uh, but yeah, Dirty Work Spank Mercino, SJM with kind of a big upset on CNS. Wow, that's crazy. Um, so we uh, we dropped down to fifth. Hmm. Woof. I know. Hmm. Only one point above, yeah, yeah, you know. Hmm. But the good news is, 
next week. The bar. Well, no, the barn tunes are on fire. Oh, the Griffins. Isn't that right, Timmy? They are. We are yeah. buzzing. <laughs> I think. I think we're on a four a four game win streak right now, and uh, there's no there's no stopping in sight. We got the Grand Blank team next week. We're gonna beat up on those little punks. Didn't they beat you last time you played them? That don't worry, don't worry about it. <laughs> they had to bring in. They had to bring in some ringers. We took them lightly. It won't happen again. We're gonna beat some ass. I, I Garrett, I told Connor after uh, after our game Monday at the barn. I said the the senior tunes they better do their thing this weekend because oh well the I'll regular Goonie tunes are buzzing. I I like. I like where we're sitting. I think we're going to be just fine. I think we're going to be A-OK. Are we going to talk about that a little bit more? Yeah, or? we'll talk about it a little bit. I got one more thing before that, but unless you guys have anything else on uh, on around the league. I don't know. I thought SJM beating CNS was, was a pretty big upset. That's, that's unless, pretty good. My, yeah. only, my only thinking is, though, we had the, they brought in a couple guys against us last week, uh, right. a couple younger guys. I think they might just be on the team permanently. That's kind of what I, I – I didn't watch the game tape. But uh, maybe. Did you watch it so you didn't watch it at all? No, I just checked the website okay. for the scores. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Buzz no, I'll leave the scouting up to you, coach. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, we got a, well, since we had Eric on, I thought it would be pertinent to do a segment we haven't done in a little while. Check up on our Midland boys. A little Midland Woo-hoo. minute. Oh, boy. <laughs> we don't need a minute for this. Well, hey, okay. Nice picture of Shane. Well, yeah. Like that? I found it. Yeah. Thought it was thought it was fitting. A little shade shot. Hmm. Big blue ox are struggling, huh, E? Yeah, it's not good. Who's your? Where's your? Uh, the next question I got probably don't have it up. Where's their like lead scorer at? Big Blue Ox. He their lead scorer I th- think is Eric. Yeah. Ugh. Oh boy. Oh, no, th- no. Sorry, they have one guy above. Or no, they have three guys at eleven points. Okay, but still, Nick, Nick, my, Nick Matt, and Eric are all at eleven. <laughs> and that, those 11, are my line. Those are my line mates. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <clears throat> All right, let's put Tyler, Dan, and Connor on the line. Let's see who produces the most. <laughs> <laughs> so, and, and, I wouldn't be I wouldn't be opposed to that if we if we wanted yeah, to try that yeah, for a game. You, yeah. Let's try that on Sunday. Let's try that against Dirty Work. Oh God, no, one shift, be... one shift, just do, one. just for the first period. One I'm shift to first period. I'm thinking about it. Just a thought. Well, what what are the other lines going to be then? Don't don't worry. Who cares? Who yeah, cares? Yeah, who cares? Yeah. <laughs> Tim, you'll start. Oh, we're gonna second, go. You'll start the second line. period. How Tim? long do you guys need before you can go back out? There? I would say, yeah, we're gonna yeah. go yeah. every. We're gonna go every other shift. We're gonna take minute and a half, two minute shifts, and then get yeah. a thirty second breather. The other three guys are just out there to give us a bre- a, a break. You'll start the second period, Tim. Yeah, <laughs> perfect. Yeah, Tim, you'll get to see ice the second period. Yeah. <laughs> if we get a if we get a penalty. Put kill, me Tim, in, we'll, coach. I'm ready we to play. A, <laughs> Get a penalty. Tim keep touching his phone because he's getting like text messages or something. No, I gotta, <laughs> I gotta uh, slide back and forth if I want to see to go from <laughs> to see everybody. <laughs> and, you know, you improvise. Tim, are you on Tinder with Brian? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, Shane's struggling a little bit. Only seven Shane, points. Shane showed up to probably about four games to be honest oh, with wow. you. Oh, really? He, yeah. Hmm. That, How's that, he feeling? Is he still a little tight? He's he's upright and moving. He's a little okay. cautious. That's uh, good. But I think with yeah. seven guys, we'll be fine. Yeah, and especially he's there's no pressure. You know, we'll get into it. We'll get into that, it. That's All right, well, here, yeah, we'll just senior tunes. We'll just yeah. yeah, we'll just pop over there right now. So Yeti Cup got our rosters finalized and we got our schedules. And uh, so those of you who want to come out, <laughs> hang out, it's going to be like negative five out on the lake. So dress warm mm. if you do. But it's at the uh, Stego Lake County Park. There's the address. Uh, the Goonie, t- so it's kind of cool. I don't know. It just, just kind of worked out this way. Our games are staggered, so we play at ten, and they play at ten forty. So we just kind of played back to back. Just noticed the yeah. yeah. Do you like, did you like? Do you like the Senior oh, Tunes logo? Oh, God. For, for our listeners, the Goonie Tune emblem for the Senior Tunes got glasses and white, <laughs> like a <laughs> white head. That looks like a lightning bug with its ass lit up. <laughs> Oh, well I, done. <laughs> I thought that was fitting. You know, they're the, yeah, senior, well they're, they're, they're the senior tunes. Yeah. Um, but yeah, Garrett, so since we talked about this last, you've picked up a ringer. Um, I, I think call him Tim, a the I think, guy. well, you another guy too. Well, t- we don't need another guy. We no, have our, we, we get we, seven. What's up? 
I mean, I know you're the type of guy that likes to have a full roster with everything you do in life, but why yeah. seven? Why or when? Why? Why? Because when's the last time you played pond hockey? Uh, this last Saturday. Okay. It's going to be, it's going to be a smoke. Well, with, with Shane, you know, being questionable, I think good move. Yeah, because you got to yeah, remember, if, 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 you only, if you only had six and Shane only plays the first two games and he can't play the second two, then you're down to five. Yeah. And one yeah. of those five is John. Yeah. Oh. If yeah, John, honestly, if John goes, goes, goes At up. that point, when I talked to him, uh, he skates with me on Wednesdays. I wasn't sure if Shane was in or not. So I'm like, you know what? We'll pick him up so that way we have six guaranteed. If yeah. Shane wants to play, cool. If not, cool. Let me so, ask yeah. you this because I'm sure the I'm sure the viewers are wondering about this. Does Steve bring the average age of the senior tunes up or down? I believe he brings it down. I think he's like 32, 33. Oh I think wow! Is like 30 wow. Yeah. Eric, Eric, Eric goes. Oh, okay. Never mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good call. I'm 32. Yeah. 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 All right, Steve. If you're listening, bring some game. Yeah. Wait. Yeah. Yeah. Does Steve listen? Is Steve? Uh, is Steve uh, like and subscribe? I don't think so, but I will definitely bring it up today. That and tell him that we talked about it in the podcast. Yeah. Please yeah. do. Um. But yeah, it should be a good time. Uh. We're done. Like you. We're done by 12:30, and you guys are gonna be done by like 3:30 on Saturday. Yeah. So. Holy be, fuck! That's yeah. gonna be. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna be a long night Saturday night. I got I do I Connor, I do gotta ask what's uh what's your game plan? Are you guys doing two lines or I think we're gonna I think we're gonna start run I think we're gonna start out doing two lines. I think right now the plan is me, Ian, and Knack, and then Reader, Tyler, and Bobby. I think that's the plan for the three lines. And then we'll just, you know, have a one guy that plays, you know, that's like the the defenseman and have those two guys switch for each other and then have the other two guys be Although, you know, Tim, you know this, these other two yahoos don't, but when you play pond hockey, it's a lot of, there's a lot of fluid motion, a yeah. lot of fluid positions. Yeah, Probably it's like basketball. Guy. You stay on a guy and you hold them to get the puck the whole time. It's one-on-one hockey the whole time. Kind, kind of, sort of. And, and if I said set up a triangle, Garrett's going to be like, what do you mean a triangle? Yeah, half the guy you that you know what a triangle is. You have to rotate. Have to rotate. That's right. Tim, you should be up there coaching them. I, it's, yeah, they're going to be, they're going to be lost without you. I know if I could be off there, I would, but we had prior commitment. So mm. Mm. what can you do? Are you going to be there for the game on Sunday? Yeah, I'll be there for the game. Okay. Well, all right. All right. We'll miss you, but not really. Yeah. I know. Have a great time. No, it should be a good time. We're, uh, I think we're going to have a little warm, like a little uh, ice fishing tent shack thing out on the ice, hopefully. So we can, Try and get warm in between games. Your goddamn clown car. Everybody yeah, knows. yeah, yeah. I know. I'm. It, I'm very glad that we're not like off at the same time because I don't think we'd be able to yeah, fit like true. 16 guys in the little ice fishing shins. Well, I would love to get a video of the 16 guys in the tent and then just have each one come out <laughs> one at a time. Yeah. <laughs> so we'll have oh, Tavis yeah. announce everybody's statements like. Come yeah. <laughs> and oh, how many shit. guys are going up for the weekend? 16. Oh, so we, yeah, one seven <laughs> and two more. Yeah, yeah. Right, Thir- 13 players. No, and then Tavis and Embry. So that's 15. Uh, 15. Plus yeah, 15. Reader's dad is 16. Oh, is holy it Brandon moly. going up too, possibly? Yeah, I don't know about Brandon. He was talking about like taking like taking off of work just to come up. He's like, yeah, I have to move. So uh, we'll see. Jimmy Howard? No, no. No, no. Uh, Crystal, no. Crystal Field House. No, yeah. that's, no, that's Brendan. No, Brandon is the guy that makes the chicken sandwich yeah. at the Crystal Field chicken House. Chicken sandwich, oh. Brandon. Oh, yeah. yeah. Crystal Field House, Brandon. Yet. We're looking forward to it. Very yeah, long. looking yeah. forward to it next exactly. Sunday. Yeah. Which a couple of guys had had some uh, some burgers and stuff after or yesterday after Tyler's uh, A-League game. Top notch, they said. So I'm excited. To it. I'm excited. Huh. Garrett, who are you most nervous? I guess Garrett and Eric. Who, what, just based on the team names, who are you most nervous for? I'm gonna go Warrior Alpha. Just because Warrior Hockey, you know, might have something to do. I don't know. It's the only reason because I know Warriors are sponsor. No, I. If I had to, just looking at them, I'd say Pizza House number one. Well, I, th- they're not playing Pizza House number one. Yeah, Tim, I, I know. Asked... And your name's not Eric, Tim. Oh my <laughs> goodness. <laughs> Does your phone do you can you not hear through your phone, Tim? Well, let me go get two pennies so I can give you my two cents. Oh, oh okay. Boy. All right. Well, maybe you should just turn the phone off. That was <laughs> Eric, please. Would you is 
after Tim rudely interrupted you. Yeah. So I, I have to guess Zamboni and Black Ice are probably a hockey team, like two different teams. So I got a feeling one of those two teams probably has an A squad and the other one's a B squad. Yeah, but yeah, but I mean, maybe. I don't know, but so would they be doing the same thing in uh, like I, Pizza I House would... one and two? But they're see, in the I same can... division. See, I mean, we we took the young guys and put them, you know, with a little more endurance. You can, we took you can say we have a we have a varsity team and a JV team. We have a varsity <laughs> team and a JV team. That's fair to say. Now, yeah, we have a, a senior team that's full of older, more wiser gentlemen. <laughs> okay. And then younger team that's just kind of the riffraff. You know what they call the senior tour on the PGA tour now is it's the championship tour. Oh so. yeah. yeah oh. The senior tour was too insulting to the old, the old farts that were on it. <laughs> well, you look hey. at everyone that's on it. They're all champions. Yeah. Okay. Fair enough. Yeah. I'm, I'm nervous. We'll see. I'm nervous for our first game on the rocks, 10, 10 o'clock on the rocks. It's going to be cold. We'll see. I think, I think we're going to be okay though. I'm, I'm predicting we go, at worst, three and one on the first day. Ooh. Well, and here's the thing is, I feel like after you play Pizza House number two, you'll probably have a good idea what you're going to be facing at two. Yeah, for, yeah against Pizza House number one. <laughs> you know what I mean? Because you're yeah, going to be able to, you know, the same team. So you kind of have an idea what kind of talent. Um, that's a good point. Yeah. Yeah. So you have that. You know, I'm just worried. End of the day, 240. Ugh, that's gonna be a that's gonna be a long what is it twenty minute half or something like that? <laughs> I think they're I, oh. I think they're like either fifteen or twenty minute running time halves. Yeah, I think fifteen. Well, okay, don't yeah. get too full because at twelve forty you gotta have a side of applesauce there. So, <laughs> all right, you know what? At this point, I'm glad you're not going. Yeah, <laughs> I'm glad. Well, it's a good thing you don't t- catch me at one twenty, Tim, because I'll be a hooligan. <laughs> Can we just? Holy fright. People, people have a certain expectation for the show, guys. All right. Can we at least try and live up to it? We just need a fart noise machine. Yeah, yeah. At this point, like, why? All right. I had one one last thing. And I don't, this just randomly came across my Twitter timeline like two days ago. And I thought, and I completely forgot about it. So, do you guys remember the Guardian Project? No. Yeah. I remember this. Yeah. Okay. So oh, this was, man, yeah. This was in 2011, yeah. like right when Marvel was starting to kick off. Yep. The NHL and Stan Lee joined forces to create the Guardian Project, oh where they gave all of the NHL teams a superhero. And they, they revealed them one by one, starting in January of 2011, all the way up till January 30th, were at the All-Star game. And these are just some of the, these are just some of the Guardians. And I was looking through them, and they are so dumb. What I, I don't understand Buffalo and the Penguins, like the, the Penguin. He he's the Penguin. Do you want me to look him up for you so you can read what he does? Does he do like? Does he waddle? <laughs> like he uh, doesn't even look like a penguin. That's the thing. Well, no, he's a guy. He's yeah. Hold on, hold on. I'll, I'll tell you what the Penguin does. The Wild looks like Michael Jackson's <laughs> werewolf from Thriller. Yeah. Are you ready? Are you ready for this guy? This is so good. The gritty young savior of the Steel City can project oh, ice missiles from his hands and travels on a frozen <laughs> ice sheet. None of that makes sense. <laughs> None of that makes sense with penguins. At least like the Red Wing, you know, you get the car thing. Uh, I get that. He looks Predators. like a transformer. All the power of a Formula One race car and an F-14. That's the Red Sharks, Wing. Sharks, at least a shark. The Buffalo, you had two options. that could have made him like a human buffalo or, you know, a guy with swords. And I guess he's got a sword, an ice sword. <laughs> Or a man bear pig. Hold on, I'll look yeah. up the, I'll look up the <laughs> saber. The, sa- the saber is a human hydroelectric plant. Manipulates water in all its forms from liquid, solid, and gaseous. I don't even know. <sighs> Woof. <laughs> like, come on. Who, I guarantee the, best- <laughs> the person who was writing these and had to draw these doesn't watch hockey. <laughs> well, you mean I, Stan I, Lee? I see, Stan, I, like, I, I'm not going to disparage Stan Lee. He's like one of the greatest... Like I know I doubt it was I guarantee yeah, it was I, 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 know, I think it was just he just put his name on it but yeah it's really funny because there's like I think three or four that are basically the same thing and like you can see the Bruin the Predator and the Wild are all just like a, a man beast hybrid kind of thing and it's, <laughs> yeah. that's just that's just all it is. Jeez. So yeah, geez. man bear pig. Yeah. Man bear pig. That's right. That's right. <laughs> that's I, don't know, I just I saw this and it, it was I mean there's some like yeah there's some bad ones. Um. Mm. What do you guys think if there was a Goonie Tunes Guardian? 
we i mean we had one it was shane for a while <laughs> not, that was, not that, was, the ma- that was the mascot that was the mascot oh okay i don't know man Ooh. what do you think his powers would be the the flint the flint goonie tunes <laughs> remember it doesn't have to relate in any way to the actual Clearly. the actual thing so Something you can just with crime and bad water <laughs> <laughs> that's why he's green yeah <laughs> Oh, man. hydrated on Flint's H two O, straight from the Kersey Creek. Yeah. <laughs> oh, Holy geez. shit! Milt Steel Strong from GM's finest motor plant from the sewage. <laughs> leftover, uh, yeah, it's made from leftover steel from the Buick plant. <laughs> the three eyed fish from the Simpsons. Yeah. Oh man. Oh shit! But yeah, if you if you never heard of the Guardian Project. Go check it out. It was ridiculous. Uh, it got absolutely no traction, and it died almost immediately after it was finally revealed. So, and here we are bringing it back. I did. I just. I. I. I, I, I recalled it. Yeah, thought it was funny. Thought it'd be fun to talk about. All right, boys. Anything else? It's gonna be I'm a long weekend. Really I'm looking ready. forward to this weekend. I'm very yeah. excited. Been on the really calendar fun. for a while now, so it's uh, finally here. I'm like glad Chris- we were able to get two teams. I know we were talking yes. about doing that. I'm very glad we were able to get two teams. I think it's going to work time. out well, too, yep. like division-wise. And, yo, know, okay, so I was playing hockey in the basement with my boy because that's just what I do. And I was thinking, what if, knock on wood, both tunes win? <laughs> There's no way. Anything's possible. I don't know, man. I don't know. Then, it, then our bet's a push, Connor. Then yeah. our bet's a push. Also, hey. I just want I just want it on the record. If for some reason the senior tunes do go further than the Goonie tunes, the bet will be officially under protest because Garrett brought in a ringer post the bet being made. Ah, uh, whatever. Under no, pro- I'm just, it's under protest. It's under protest. Okay, okay. So make the bet again. Clear sheet. So I'm going well, maybe, back to the, well, maybe the I don't want to. thing. I guess we're going to be the weasel now. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying the bet was made, and then the and then the parameters around the bet were changed. The but guy the bet made, made, that didn't make the parameters. That's like being upset that uh, you know the lines changed somebody out at the last minute. Doesn't matter. Doesn't yeah, matter. Bro, go go call the odds. The Jackson, odds are different. I want I want better. I want better odds now, Tim. Don't do it. <laughs> don't I want do better it. odds now. See, he's getting scared. There's already a good chance I'm, I'm not buying getting, you a I'm not Luigi's getting, pizza. No, oh, not. you're for sure buying me a Luigi's pizza. There's no way these guys are even – they're, they're going to make it – I mean, I guess they – so it's it's actually – it's kind of shitty because we have eight that's teams. Go by wins. Just go by wins. We, that's what we're going to have to do because we have eight yeah. teams in our division. If we finish fifth, we go to, like, a lower bracket. Yeah. Whereas if we finish fourth, we're in, like, the championship bracket. Like, one through four in the championship bracket, five through eight are in, like, the constellation bracket. I mean, it'll be pretty clear. They have, the they have six teams. Well, if we're all... going to go by wins, then this bet is null and void because that wasn't the original bet. Oh, <laughs> well, what do I you want to do? What do you want to do? You want to just, just call that the bet? Too. All right, here. Okay, all right, fine. <laughs> we're going to re- revamp the bet because – because get they have an extra guy and because oh, the brackets Lord. are different so more wins. do we want to do winning percentage no just more wins so i also wait this is this is going to get tricky now because if we lose our first game on sunday we're not playing our second game because we have to come back for a 330 game in flint so we're going to end up end up losing two games because of a forfeit and eh, that's your call man I'll leave What's that up to Tim. Forward? I'll leave that up to Tim. Well, I guess it's not going to matter because it's not a win. Like, we're not doing more. Right, yeah, if we're just losses. doing straight yeah. win. Yeah. So, what happens if, say, so you we, guys have more wins, but you guys played more games? So, that, that won't be the case. Because okay. we, 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 we both play four games on Saturday, and then yeah. we both are guaranteed one game on Sunday. Okay. So, the only way it could get dicey is if they go, like, three and two on Saturday and we go four and one. But then if they win their bracket, and then, they, you know, if they win their game on Sunday, they win their game on Sunday. So it is what it is. We will. So what happens if you guys have more wins, but somehow will, they go further? I will say this, now that I'm thinking about it. If we win our championship, we win, we play six games. If you win your championship, you, you, you could potentially play seven games. What, so if we, if we get a bye in that first If you don't. Oh yeah, I guess if you win, I guess if you win all four of your games on Saturday, you would be getting a buy. So you'd only play six games. That's true. That's, okay, that's a win. The buy is a win. The buy is not a win. Why don't we just go whoever finishes? 
higher in their division. No, because I want Sunday to matter. What, what about Sunday goals? Couldn't do goals for well, versus most, goal, most, most goals scored. No, no, no. Do no. Goal, goals. <laughs> take, 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 take the difference of goals for and goals against. Take I'll the tell difference. You what, I don't, I, I'm, I'm actually a little worried that that's going to be a tiebreaker because if that's a tiebreaker, like you have no choice, but to run up the score on a team that you're smoking. I do it. <laughs> like you really don't. Yeah. No, it's you a have tournament. to. You run up the score regardless. Okay. All right. Cut. I like cutthroat Timmy. <laughs> well, no, I mean, you have Bug to, em. like you said, you have to, if there's a chance that's, that's going to be a tiebreaker. That's what I'm that's- saying. If, if, if you end up like, not, like taking it easy on a team and just beating it by a couple goals and then you end up losing out because you, you your goal differential was worse. Right. You might need to revisit. Okay. So let's just say more wins. It's more, games. it's more wins. Whoever has the most wins. But, okay. So you guys win all four games. We win zero on Sunday and then we win out and win the championship. We still yeah. have four wins and you guys will only have three wins. Yeah. So you would win the bet. That's and correct. Lost, more wins. I say it's whoever finishes higher in their bracket. More wins. Tim, what do you want it to be? Gary, this isn't your bet. Shut up. Tim, what do you want it to be? So if you don't finish in the top bracket, then you got your net. You guys aren't going anywhere Sunday. Right. No, we no, we we would still play. We would still, you would the, still have we a would, chance to win it all. We would still not not win it all, but we would. So there's like a top four bracket, and then there's a bottom four bracket. Is they don't they don't, they don't, they don't, they don't ever they don't ever play each other. Basically, the top four bracket, the winner of the top of the, of the bottom four bracket gets fifth place. Nah, are you sure? I thought I looked at yours. Positive. I just looked at it. Right, it it's it's really funky though. They're basically guaranteeing everybody two games on oh, Saturday. Oh yeah, on, on Sunday. Okay. Yeah, it's weird. Well, yeah, they're just they're they're dividing up into two divisions. Yeah, top four and bottom four. Yeah, that's weird. It's really so, weird. I agree. Are we? Doing... I feel like we're probably comp- there's going to be a clear winner. I feel like. I can't wait for there not to be a clear winner for this for this and for this and for this bet and for this bet to just be an ongoing debate. <laughs> Goody Tunes is canceled because Tim and Connor hate each other. Yeah. <laughs> and Tim's not even going to be there. So like if, be uh, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. I'm not worried about it. I think we're going to absolutely kick ass. And I think you guys are going to just be like a middling. Oh, just there to have a good time. I'm, I'm so excited for this thing. I'm glad you're excited. I'm glad you're excited. I, I, I hope your excitement is really high right now. Cause come like noon on Saturday, it's going to be. We only won one game. My team sucks. <laughs> I wish I was on the senior Cooney tunes. <laughs> uh, you'll never hear me say that. Never, never. Okay, so we, we're, gonna have, hey. we're, gonna have, we're gonna have female friends all around to be like, oh my god, the CD goodies are just so cool. And I'll be like, sorry, ladies, I'm married, <laughs> but this parent guy is <laughs> Connor's gonna be like, oh, of course they won, they're in the lowest division. Yeah, exactly. The other yeah. guys oh, I have oh, little listen. chairs and push cards. Listen, listen, if I could bring up my excuse list right now, I would. It is <laughs> lengthy. Start it is, writing it. It is. Oh, it's already been written. I got every it's excuse like, in the book. For months. Oh, hey, for no, sure. Number one excuse. We lost because we didn't have Tim on our team. No, <laughs> no, the, the, we, were, we didn't have all of our pad hockey guys on our team. The number, the number one excuse is they had to bring guys from the A division down into our division because there weren't enough teams in the A division. That's excuse number one. I don't even know if that's true, but it might. No, be. it's not true. Yeah. Oh, it definitely could be. There's, we're the highest division. No, so there's the not house, one. The open yeah, ones, the opens the highest. No, I think opens the lowest. Opens the highest. Are you sure? I'm so, 75% sure. If you're already at the high division, how does somebody get brought down? Because there was the supposed highest? to be a division above ours. Okay. There was supposed to be an A division, and then our, we're like the BC division, and then you guys are in the DE division. Yeah, open is the men's and co-eds comparable AB league. Oh, it's co-eds. Okay, well, so you're good. So it's Open co-eds. is just anybody. That's, that's why it's called the open. Yeah. Okay. All right. So you guys might be in a worse league than us. No, we're for sure not over. No, we're not in the open. We're in the slap shot. You guys are in the icing. Yeah, we're in the icing. <laughs> Which are just such good names. Very fitting. Hey, I just Tim. Hey, so can I get a slice of that that pie when Connor's buying? I don't know what you. I, no, yeah, you're not allowed. Sure. You're not yeah. allowed. Hey, so, if I'm working, if I'm working for Tim's Pizza, I'm gonna get a slice. Yeah, and if I'm not getting a piece, then I'm just gonna keep icing the puck every time I shoot it. There you, there you go, go. Oh, Eric. <laughs> Eric, if you if you throw the game for the senior tunes, you can have some of my pizza. <laughs> It'll be like Eric got a Berkeley to win it. It's like <laughs> slap shot. <laughs> the Goody Tunes won. Yeah. <laughs> huh? You hear Connor from the sideline. 
Luigi's Pizza. <laughs> we'll get whatever toppings you want. <laughs> you could have it all. <laughs> uh, I was going to, oh, so I was, I, one thing I am a little bit nervous about as far as like the actual play goes is I was looking on their website and they have some pictures of what I think was like the rinks last year. And they had like one big net. Yeah, I mean, I if you look at this one, they got the, the wood box. Yeah, but is it is it just one big wood box? I like one big small. opening? Because the picture I saw just had like one probably like four foot opening so instead of like, like the two, I think they're like 16 inch openings. Are we talking take backs? No, 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 no. no, no. no. It's, it's, it's one on each end. But so like when, so uh, USA Pond Hockey, their goals are like you, the ones I built when we put out on my pond. Yeah, okay. Like there's, you know, there's two little openings on each end. Yeah. The, the picture I saw had, it was like one big net. Okay. Like a four foot opening where any, you know, that was the net. Oh yeah. I see what you're talking about. Yeah. Yeah. But, I mean, it's kind like of a little mini know. net. Yes. It, yes. Yes. Right there. Yeah. 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 You see that? I yeah. like how I could, I could just, I could just, I could just put this in the video, but instead we're just yeah, make no, everyone no, look no. at Garrett's phone. <laughs> you know, I don't know. They might have both. Because in that other picture that I pulled up, you can tell they clearly have one of the box. Uh, maybe the that's, wood, maybe like that's the, for yeah, the, the open. Box. Yeah, I don't know. We'll see. I, so I'm, I'm hoping the it's the box one because if not, that's gonna, there's going to be a lot of goals. But maybe that's what they want. Maybe they want a lot of goals scored. Nah, that's not fun. Then you just then then, then all you're doing is just shooting the puck. Well, it's it's that every Sunday anyway. Who me? No, I said we. What try to score goals? Yeah, we just shoot the puck. Well, some of us are better at it than others. Well, that's you know debatable. Oh, well, you know, I guess. Do I need the, to go? Uh, do I need to go back to this? Out. Do I need to go back to the stat sheet page? No, nope. hey, we can we can we can debate know, it then. It, it helps that we feed you the puck all the time. <sighs> no, no, you don't. We've already talked about this. Pucks, I do. pucks in my skate, three feet behind me, no, into I the netting. Do. Nope. Yeah, into yeah. the net. You got yeah. yeah. I mean, there's a fifty percent of the podcast right now has double digit points. So that's true, Tim. Well, and then, uh, then the, and then another guy has double digit points in his other league. Who's the fourth guy? Tim? Sure. Oh. The oh. guy you put on D. Yeah. <laughs> okay. For the record, I didn't put you anywhere. I suggested it. I suggested it. It was, was I, you have the final call and all lineup decisions and all goalie. No, pulling no, and, decisions. and I'm not going to play D again. And I'm not going to pass the puck. To Kyle. Please don't play D again. <laughs> Don't. I'll, it I'll might make you. sense. I don't know. Who else are we going to move back there? It does not no. matter. Anyone. Literally oh, anyone. Yeah, I don't. will move back and play D. Was that that bad? I didn't think I was that bad. I know I didn't have a great game, hence the, the fucking gong guy. There were a couple oh. times when I had to, like, tell you to cover the guy that was wide open out in front of the net when you're defensive. No, no, no. no. There's. I know what time you're talking about. There was one, because I went, there was two seconds left. I went to go to the corner because What's-His-Face was coming back from a rush. Oh, so it was just me. Oh, okay. That's not true. <laughs> That's not what happened. I don't. I didn't. Exactly. I never said I believed him. He's making shit up. You should just debate it instead of pulling up the tape. Yeah. Listen, hey. I don't have all night. We started this recording late, so I don't have time to go pull out, pull up all this tape. I got to get to bed at a reasonable hour. I got to get my sleep, and I have a big tournament this weekend. Um, yeah. What a r- quick question. Beer situation for the weekend. Oh, we're gonna discuss that, on, we'll discuss oh. that on the show. I like that. Over under how many cases drank? Ooh. Oh, so you can assume like everybody's gonna at least bring a case. So here's Correct. the here's the, I don't I don't I'm not drinking beer. Oh, you're still not drinking beer? Well, I told so I told Tim I was gonna weigh myself uh Thursday night or Friday uh-huh. morning, and depending on where I'm at, I may or may not be drinking beer on Saturday. You should drink Friday man, Saturday. make an excuse. Come on. Yeah. That's fine. We'll just turn you upside down and butt guzzle it down you. I'll bring some <laughs> duct tape and we'll duct tape you to the fucking like flagpole or something <laughs> john john says to me yesterday he goes if we're done by like three i'm finishing 24 beer saturday night <laughs> i said okay john. We'll be coming to the game. <laughs> we, we i would i would estimate so there's what there's 15 of us i would guess 18 cases mm. 15 cases a case a guy yeah Man, maybe a little less than that maybe like 12 cases over two, oh well, who's all going up? Uh, anybody going up Friday? Everybody's going up Friday. Everybody's yeah. up. So it depends on how tuned up you're going to get Friday. Night. Well, I don't think we're going to. I'm not planning on getting too tuned up Friday. 
Well, I'm, okay, and I know, I and never, I know, and I know, and I know. <laughs> well, I know, well, I know, because I talked, I talked, I talked to, I talked to Tyler about this, and he was like, "Yeah, I'm definitely not getting tuned up." Last time we had a tournament, Tim and I got fucked up the night before, and I played like shit the next day. And I, I had a shut up. He goes, I definitely won't be drinking Bud Heavy and smoke, smoking a joint with Tim before the game. And that was our problem is with Bud Diesel. So yikes. Yeah. And a lot of Yeah, who suggested that? Oh, huh, I wonder. <laughs> I didn't want to walk out of that, you know, bodega looking like a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> You and then you asking and then you asking Ben how he felt about dr- driving while you guys were drinking. Was so funny. <laughs> he was like, uh, no. <laughs> It'll be fine. We'll be good. We'll be good. Oh shit. Senior and, tunes, and, stretch. And, and sleeping arrangements are all figured out. Oh no. That's kind of that's why I'm getting up early. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, if you drink a shit are you bringing up your sleep app machine no so i don't need it anymore i don't believe you okay yeah who hey who said that you everyone that's ever had no no, ever- no 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 no. at hunting i still need it and i and i said i forgot it and that's on me i have why don't, why don't I, you need uh, it anymore well i uh, should i guess because we got a humidifier in the room i guess we're probably not going to have one up yeah there. we're not going to have that up there because let me tell you, that just cleans everything out. Not not snoring. Yeah, it's going to be it's when dry you, as hell it's up when there. You, it's when you get fucked up. That's when you snore. Yeah. Yeah. So to sleep with me. <laughs> I will. I don't if care. You're, we if, had, hey, we had me. we had snoring wars up at the golf trip. Remember? <laughs> yeah. And I had my mask on, and it wasn't me snoring. It was you. I got wow. video proof. I had a lot of so, That's going to be so so many guys after doing oh, yeah. so much. It's going to be so loud in that. Place. I do We're, have an early uh, prediction for the game chain for the weekend. Okay the plumbing on their cottage <laughs> <laughs> i just i hope I, i'm i i don't i don't have an air mattress or nothing i got a sleeping bag and a pillow i'll so bring i have an air mattress i'll bring one up um, yeah, i'm planning on bringing an air mattress shane too. doesn't have an air mattress so we'll, we'll be all right we'll be all right i don't care if i have to sleep with somebody i'll have my sleep I don't care, I don't care if somebody yeah sleep with i said be ready to sleep with a cousin or a buddy so uh, not to butt man uh and then, so are we going to have like an official bedtime? Because no. y- you know, Bice and Phil, <laughs> Bice and Phil are going to go ham. Hey, Waving their guns around. Exactly. <laughs> Who wants to go out and shoot a gun? Wow. <laughs> oh, man. No. I feel like will probably try to stay up because he's like, oh, wife's not here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. But yeah, hey, those are the two I'm worried about on the senior tunes. Oh, Bison, Bison, Phil? Bison Phil? Hey, yes. How, how many one mores are going to happen? Not oh, to mention boy. John. You know John's away for the weekend. You know what he's going to do? That's going to be some damage. I'm going to pick up a 36 rack of LBLs from Costco. That's what I was planning on doing, too. Hey, just uh-huh. make sure when you bring up that 30 ra- 36 rack, it's actually a 36 rack, because the last time you brought a 36 rack up north, it was like half gone. I got bored on my way up. <laughs> The other thing is, is anyone buying any pink, hotel, yeah. anyone buying any pink Whitney for the weekend? I have a fifth of pink Whitney. One. I think I still have some of my. Yeah, own. for my team. I also have a fifth of hot damn. The house Ooh. divided. Garrett, we should get some of that for our team. I'll pick up a uh, pink Whitney if you want to get the hot damn. I already have pink. So Whitney that that reminds me. All right. I know we were doing it pre-COVID and whatnot, but we're on a little losing streak. For our regular Goonie tunes, do we need to bust out the Pink Whitney shot before the game? That's for the playoffs. Yeah, playoffs. We have for the playoffs. Oh, my mistake. You're not forgiven, but yeah, whatever. it's not your fault. You're on your like phone. You're on the shopping week. block. Yeah. It's, not your, it's not your fault. You're on your phone this week. <laughs> How much data have you used, Tim? Too much. I got unlimited data, so. Ooh, fancy boy. Unli- unlimited data, money. but can't pay for his Wi-Fi. <laughs> no, that, I, that is his Wi-Fi. <laughs> You're just putting him in Yeah. That's my hot spot. <laughs> Before we sign off, um, two things. Are we going to have a Goonie Tune Pond Hockey Edition this weekend? Any videos, recording, anything like that? I am plan. I am planning on it, so I'll make sure I talk to the guys. I'm planning on sending another email out uh, Thursday night uh, before we take off. But I want to remind everybody, everybody, like, take take videos, take videos of 
everything and anything, pictures, videos, even, you know, the games, in between the games, hanging out, driving up, all that shit. Every, yeah. Anything you can think of, take a video of it and send it to me and I'll, it's probably yeah. going to take me a couple of weeks to edit it all down, but. We can create a shared folder and you can just drop stuff in there, if you, especially with iPhones. It's super easy. That's what we do with Leo's pictures. Okay. All right. Yeah. We'll figure that yeah, out. Yeah, that's not a bad idea. And, it, and you'll have access to it. How big is Joe's cabin? We don't uh, know. <laughs> I don't think huge. Is it around anyone else? I think so. Yes. Okay. Because I was thinking, if you can see in the background. Oh, you're gonna bring your speaker? <laughs> well, I had thought about it, but hey, if, you it's, if you then? if you bring it, if you bring it, bring it. I mean, is, is it gonna get? Is it gonna hurt it sitting out in your car? Well, that's the concern with it being uh, as cold and speaker. I, would say I don't want to. It. It's not that big. You just bring it, put it in a corner. If we don't use it, we don't. Well, use it. I don't. Yeah, but you know. if it if it breaks, I mean, it was what seventy bucks. Yeah, exactly. It's, not, it's no beach by hey, seventy for shipping. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna keep it here. That's, um, probably, that's, that's probably the smart idea. I'm sure. I don't, I don't think his house is that big. So we can just use a regular Bluetooth uh, speaker boy, or something. This, this is going to be like how many guys can fit in a garage this weekend? Pretty much. Pretty Yikes. much. So. Ooh, I, so I have a space heater. If he's got a garage. Should... I'm sure they have a space heater up there. Okay. Do they have a garage up there? I uh, have absolutely. I don't know what's up there. I have no idea. I've never been. Half I the love, fun. Half I the love, fun. It's, it's love, literally yeah. half the fun. <laughs> I love how much Reader has told us about. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody knows. Anything. Nobody knows. I think he's doing that on purpose. The more uh, uh, I think it's, it'll be, it'll be a fun. It'll be a good it'll time. It'll be the size of the meat locker. <laughs> yeah. No <laughs> shit. Now he doesn't even have a cottage. <laughs> <laughs> it's just an RV. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, shit. All right, boys. Well, that was a great episode. 20 in. I think we're finally getting the hang of it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, maybe. Like Brand new news. uh eric thank you for joining us at all as always thank uh you thank you again me. for uh for the new intro and Absolutely. the new outro that everybody is about to hear they yes both kick ass yes um we will hopefully see some of you this weekend at family night once again it's this sunday 6 15 bring oh, your kids. wives girlfriends kids parents in-laws neighbors every anybody and anybody bring them to family Mistresses. night what do we play? Dirty work. Uh, dirty work. Mm. So it should be a good game. Might be might, might get a little feisty. They had the last couple of times we played them, so it should be fun. Um, but you if might don't... see me being a little stylish out there. Oh god, I forgot about that. Uh. <laughs> Timmy Styles. Maybe, maybe don't. Maybe don't bring your kids. <laughs> maybe. Yeah. Maybe maybe gonna be, let me just say this. Come come to warm ups. You might see me no bucket. Oh Jesus. <laughs> no bucket and AirPods in. <laughs> Hey, until you go behind the net and someone domes one with a puck off your head. Hey, what do you mean yeah. behind the net? He could be anywhere. He just gives you a bunch of pucks flying towards. <laughs> Lord, if we don't Lord. see you, if we don't see you next Sunday, we will talk to you guys next week. And as always, go Goonie Tunes. Go to Peace. now but you will i can already feel it title this episode too many fred lines <laughs> that's actually a pretty good i'll tell you what that's the hardest part about i, I don't know why i decided to start coming up for episode episode no, titles, uh, title it, the, makes uh, it, it makes it way it makes the it fred like line bukaki it's not no. gonna put bukaki in our title <laughs> name oh, oh. Tim, yeah tim gets bukaki by the fred lines <laughs>